Hello and uh, welcome to another vlog. This one is going to be a very short vlog. Uh, last week I spent time with my son and his family in Wiltshire and this week I've spent time with my daughter and her family on the Isle of Wight. So I've been doing my grandpa bit and really enjoying time with the grandchildren. So in essence this video is going to just focus on the flight from um, Calais to Santa Maria. Um, we had a problem with the camera. If you remember last week, I, uh, I lost the forward facing camera halfway through the flight. Um, and for some reason I pressed the remote and I assumed that it was gonna be working uh, for the next stage of the flight. I didn't check it, I have to say. Um, so, for that part of it, I've only got the rear facing camera and the underwing. But what I have done and what I will do is I'm going to answer some questions I have had about the paperwork. Um, I appreciate those people who said that they um, enjoyed the video and it's given them a taster of what flying across the channel is. So um, what I thought I would do, I, and, and, I'm, and I'm not going to say that I've got this absolutely right. Um, it's, as far as I'm concerned, this is what I believe it should be. Now, I have got this little booklet. I'm going to change the camera um, in order to show this. But I've got this little thing that I've got in the aircraft with me. And it's the copies of the documentation that I think you need. Okay. My name is Tim Palmer, I fly a Jodel DR1050 out of this farm strip in East Anglia. On the first page of the document I've got the interception procedures which I understand you're supposed to carry with you. A couple of um, blank pages there where I included some of the paperwork that I will talk about in a little while. But if you work your way through it, I've got my permit. After my permit, I've got my certificate of registration. I've got my operating limitations, permit to fly, I've got an old noise certificate, I've got my insurance documentation, my aircraft radio license, I've got my installation certificate, and I've got a weight and balance schedule for the flight. Now that's what I've got in the book. I first planned my route on Sky Demon and having checked that I've got the waypoints where I want them to be, I've got the route where I want them to be and that all the details are there then uh, I simply press the Father Flight Plan button and let Sky Demon do the work. And they then send you a confirmation email so that you know that that's all gone through. Just as a reminder, you have to have one hour before takeoff in order to file your flight plan. That was to actually catch us out a little bit on the way back, but uh, you'll see that in a future episode. I do always use a, a waypoint for the FIR boundary which is about 11 miles out from Dover. I also use Dover itself as a waypoint and have them marked because quite often you're asked for an estimate for both. This was a flight into Calais um, and one of the things you have to do is you have to request customs um, on a special form um, and it comes from the Calais airport site. I'll put that in the description below and they need a minimum of two hours notice for that. The next little bit are the ones that, so the extra pieces of paper that I had in the folder that I was talking about. I've got COVID vaccination proof on my phone, but I also printed them off 
just in case. I believe we were supposed to have with us a sworn statement for absence of COVID symptoms. And because we were staying overnight, I think we were expected to complete a personal locator form. I also thought it would be quite a good idea to include the invitation letter from the Aero Club. But I did do something wrong. What I didn't realise is that um, according to the new GAR documentation, it does reduce the filing time from four hours to two hours, which is a lot more helpful. But I wasn't aware of the fact that it is now an expectation that outbound flights should be notified as well. So I'll have to make a note of that for the future. Gulf Echo Hotel is coasting out. Dover estimates the boundary at uh, zero 05. Cali Radio, Golf Alpha Yankee Echo Hotel. Golf Alpha Yankee Echo Hotel, can you information? Good day, sir. Golf Alpha Yankee Echo Hotel, um, Jodo DR1050 on the apron, radio check and taxi for local flight to Santa Mer. Golf Alpha Yankee Echo Hotel, can you information? Ring wind use 24, wind 24, zero degrees, 17 knots, visibility 10 kilometers. Temperature 172.10, QNH 1021, and uh, report at all input alpha. Uh, report at alpha 1021, and uh, copy runway and the wind, Gulfeca Hotel. Now, it's going to be virtually down the runway, but not 100 percent
Nothing on approach. No. Hey, code de quelle information reçu? Golf Echo Hotel is ready for departure. Echo Hotel, uh, wind 230 degrees, 17 knots. Report uh, to leave the frequency. Copy the wind and uh, we'll call Golf Echo Hotel. Et quel est le bonjour du Fox Charlie Coyon qui sort Fox, Charlie et Coyon qui tira qu'à l'information. Bonjour. Et Nyan qui sort en motoplaneur au parking de personnes à bord pour un vol à destination de Merville. Et avant de rentrer à Merville, on aimerait faire un trait de côte au niveau du Blanc-Mais. Fox, Charlie et Coyon qui tira qu'à l'information. Piste en service 24, RCR 6, avant du 240 degrés 29. Et 10 km, température 17.3 et 9 km, 1021. Un véhicule de piste euh, et le long du taxiway, euh, euh, papa 2. C'est euh, euh, quoi votre envergure euh, On est à 19 mètres d'envergure, Yankee qui sort. Euh, correction du coup, on roule bravo, Yankee qui sort. Rien qui sera reçu, vous en bravo, son envergure est trop longue. Bon, j'aurais pu décaler, hein, aucun souci. Hein. Ouais, Flaco, c'est bon, tu, tu peux rester là maintenant, il va, il va aller jusqu'en bravo et puis remonter, c'est bon. Je te remercie. It's dead in the wind. Yeah. Dock it.
Not you. mad at all under the conditions. Kip, got to be quick on your toes. Mother. That and your bowels. Yeah. Our uh, bowels are okay. Well, here we are. Back in your French home. Yes. Stick forward. Pardon? I said stick forward with oh, behind yeah. us. Your phone again. Friggin' hot in here. It is a bit. Don't do it, Tim. Keep that side. No, that yeah, if you can. I got on this side as well. Yeah, you'll snuck them up. What shall I do? Should I park it? Well, I don't know because. Our normal base. Yeah, that's. Well, I suppose it will get in there. Get, get, get dumped. I uh, think from there or there. Just that, that gets that way. I'm not wrong. That will have to be. I have to park it into wind, won't I? Yeah. We push it round from here. Yeah. Okay.